A new body cam video is released of a deadly shootout between Pueblo police and a home invasion suspect. 24-year-old Orlando Lopez was killed by officers in January near the Praise Assembly of God Church. That's on the city's east side. Get down! Get down! Police! Get down! Hey. Police say they got involved in a high-speed chase with Lopez after he broke into a home and sped away. The department says the video shows their officers were justified in using deadly force. Cardio News Channel 13's Michelle San Miguel talked with police about how video is changing law enforcement. Get down! Get down! Police! Get a down. body camera worn by Officer Jeremy Matthews captures the deadly encounter. Drop it! We're not going to play the final seconds, but it shows the suspect, Orlando Jude Lopez, fall to the ground, but then he starts to get up. It's not clear in the video, but officers say he points a gun in their direction, so they fire more shots at him. He's running there. He's running there. Guys. Police say the video not only shows the split second decisions that officers make. But also the emotional burden that they carry. Brings a different human touch to it. Um, police officers certainly are not robots, uh, and and it takes a toll on them. Pueblo police officers are hopeful that wearing body cameras will improve the relationship between law enforcement and the public. It's what we've seen here in Pueblo. Uh, many times, uh, citizens' behavior improves knowing that they're on camera and so does the behavior of the officers. The investigators are here in the captain. Moments after the shooting, yeah, also the caught on camera, police interviewing witnesses. A look at police work that we've never seen before. In Pueblo, Michelle San Miguel, KRDO, News Channel 13. And seven Pueblo police officers were involved in that shooting. Officer Matthews was the only one wearing a body camera that day.